here come in a pat we made it to epcot center you guys yeah basically holding the family together look who is waiting for me at the front door Good morning, everybody. It's another wonderful morning. Oh, yeah, like oh thank you. There's Mike and I. Pretty we are cute. here. Thank you. You're cute. We are here at Walt Disney World again for our second <laughs> day of the adult weekend at Disney. We just came over to the hotel to pick up Man and Pap. So, Uncle Chris, Aunt Sid, Aunt Wendy, Uncle Tom, Uncle Mike, Aunt Michelle, Mike and I all stayed over at Fort Wilderness and Man and Pap staying at the Swan Hotel. So we're picking them up. We're gonna go over to Uncle Mike and Aunt Michelle's and have some breakfast and then head off to Epcot. I hope the kids are doing well. They probably didn't vlog it this morning because we're up bright and early, kind of. It's 8.45 in the morning and I'm sure that they are sleeping as long as they can. So I will give them a call and um, I'm not gonna wake them up though. Oh wait, actually, never mind. I think Katie has pole vault practice. All right, this is the other thing, you guys. Do you remember a while ago I had, um, I had like puffy eye? It's happening again, look at my eye. I don't know why, so I'm gonna keep my sunglasses on today. I can't figure it out, I thought it was red dye, I thought it was raspberries, I thought it was nuts, it's, I don't know what it is, I can't figure out what the consistency is. Anyway, um, I will see you guys soon, and adios. <laughs> there go Nana Pap, good morning! Look at you got here! <laughs> you guys, you guys have the sunglasses on from the New Year's. <laughs> You guys are so funny. All right, I'm gonna give these guys a hug. Oh. All right, you guys, we have come over to Uncle Mike and Aunt Michelle's uh, house. <laughs> what is this? A okay, trailer? No, cabin, camper, camper. Yeah, that's it. That's it. And it's breakfast time. It's just so beautiful. Perfect. <laughs> it's a gorgeous day here. Uncle Mike is making breakfast. Yeah, that's a good picture, Nana. Look, he's got his little kitchen going on over here. Nice job, Mike. Morning. Good morning. Get the coffee over there. This is pretty cool. We're gonna get ourselves all nice and full before we go to the parks. I don't think the kids at home are having breakfast like this. I hope they are. I hope they're enjoying their breakfast. All right, we made it to Epcot Center, you guys. Well, I call it Epcot Center because when I worked here, it was called Epcot Center, but now it's just called Epcot. Uncle Chris? Jill, thank you. You gave me some good 50%, 50, Look at 50 sun level block. sunblock. We thought it was going to be raining the whole time here, so Aaron said she didn't bring, bring anything. It. With this, this big nose, it gets, oh, well, it gets a lot of sun. <laughs> no, you have a... Yeah. And also the bald head. Oh, oh, all right, you guys. Look what's happening here. My father and I have a contest of who can take more pictures for other people. Excuse me. What'd you do? Huh? What, did you get a point? How many was that? How many points did you get? Just one. Just one. Yeah. All right, one nothing. Dad wins. For him. He's winning, winning. Oh, look at they're looking at their picture. All right, I gotta take some pictures of people. See you guys. Hey guys, it's Katie. Oh my gosh, this is a bit troubling. Um. Anyway, so today's Saturday, and I just got back from pole vault practice. Last night, I fell asleep super early. I really sleep early, but I like, fell asleep early and I just forgot to make me happy. So it made me happy. Yesterday was it being Friday. Because now it's Saturday and we don't have school and then we don't have school tomorrow either. So that's really good. Um, and why do I look so pale? Ew. I need to get back in the sun. So I just got back from pull up. Pole vault, pole vault practice, and I'm competing on Monday, so gotta get ready to do that. It's kind of scary. I've been like playing mom around here because the boys don't clean up their dishes or like the living room or anything. So, like, I've been doing all of the dishes, feeding the cats. The cats have not been fed. Uh, I told Ryan to feed the cat, I told Ryan to feed the cats, and they didn't feed them. And like yesterday, and now, today, they were like starving, and so I fed them, and I basically feel like the most mature person alive right now. So, yeah, basically holding the family together. <sighs> I don't know what I'm gonna do today. Probably just sit around and do nothing. Watch some Netflix. Because Switch to Birth is coming off of Netflix on May 11th, and it's like May 4th right now. May the 4th be with you, so I need to go watch that. Okay. Deuces.
Maximum security, baby. It is country house on the Bro, country house. My horse. No way. He's gonna win this. Security, country house. Don't go down to the line. Bro, the favorite again. Give me that. Hey, good pick, bro. There's Chili. There we are. Alright you guys, we are ending our glorious day at Epcot. It rained a little bit, but it totally cooled the weather. There he goes. Cooled it down, it was beautiful. Thank you so much for watching our Epcot adventure. I didn't film a lot of it, but we had a great time. We met Abigail from Richmond. She was here for the cheerleading competition. So it was great to meet you, Abigail, and her friend. And um, we finished. Comment below if you were in that drilling camp. Oh, yeah, you guys. If you went to Summit here in well. Orlando, we hope it went well. Comment below if you were there. Tell us where you're from and um, how you did. Because we're totally seeing tons of cheerleaders. Katie, being a cheerleader in high school, she knows a lot of girls who, from our area, who came down for Summit. So we are anxious to hear how you did and hope you did a great job and enjoyed Orlando while you were here. We certainly did. Sorry we didn't get to see you cheer. We didn't go over there, but we were definitely um, supporting. Supporting, absolutely. It's great to see all these cheerleaders running around with their bows in their hair and their t-shirts on and their parents. Ah! <laughs> all right, we're heading back to the campground. We're staying at Fort Wilderness Campground, one of the best places we think here. Not sponsored, but so fun. <laughs> all right, we'll see you guys in a few. Hello, good morning, and happy Sunday, everybody. I am filming live from Walt Disney World. We were just down here, Mike and I, with my parents and my brother, my two brothers and their wives and my sister and her husband for a parents um, adult weekend at Disney. We had a great time. We are at the, or we stayed at the Fort Wilderness campground. This is the cabin. You can see it right here. Mike and I are the last to leave. It's um, Sunday, so it's the, the end of the weekend. And um, everybody else is already gone, except for my mom and my dad and my one brother and my sister-in-law. This is the bedroom. They are staying one more day, but Wendy and Sid and Tom and um, Chris and Mike and I are all leaving today. So... It was awesome. It was so fun. Family is everything. It was so great to be with them and have so much fun at Disney World. But now we must say goodbye. It's nice and hot out here and humid. Mike's waiting for me in the car. Oops. <laughs> is that better? All right, he's waiting for me in the car. There he is. I don't know if you could see him in there. We're going to grab some breakfast and head on to the airport. You ready? Let's do it. Let's go. Fast forward to now we are in the car, you guys. We left Orlando, and normally we film when we're on the plane, but as it turns out, Dad and I were at Disney yesterday and forgot to log or sign in, check in for our flights, and the flight, the airline that we take, you board based on, like you board the plane based on the number of, like when you checked in, so we were last. <laughs> Not totally last, but really close to last. So, and then when we picked our seats, we didn't get to choose our seats next to each other. So Dad sat in the middle, sorry Dad, next to two people he did not know. And I got to sit on the end of a different row. Anyway, because he was in the middle and I was on the end, we didn't get to film our takeoff and landing. But you guys know, you've seen us do it tens of thousands of times. But we met Emma so from Oklahoma. We did meet, was that, no, Abby. Abby from Oklahoma. We met Abby from Oklahoma in the airport. So hi, Abby, it's a pleasure to have met you. Thank you so much for coming up and saying hello to us. All right, we just arrived at home and I'm so excited to see the kids and the cats, not necessarily in that order. All right, talk <laughs> soon, bye. Look who was waiting for me at the front door. I let him in, my Zoe boy. Mwah. Hi, Edward, let's go see. Who's downstairs? 
Are Katie and Brennan, I know Brennan's at water polo practice, but let's see his run. Ryan and Katie downstairs. Let's go see. Let's go see. Hello. Yo, How are you, my guy? Wait, I need to focus right now. Okay. Okay, we'll be right, be right back. All right, we skipped a lot of time today. We came home from Florida and then went right back into the groove of doing things. Caught up with Brennan, Katie, Ryan. We went out to a charity event for our friends. Hey. Uh, what did you say? Hey. 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 So we had a fabulous weekend. So we are going to wrap up our weekend of fabulous Disney fun and the kids having their fun at home. And um, I'm going to say what made me happy this weekend. Seeing my extended family. That was so fun and being the sunshine at Disney World. It's totally awesome. I know, I have Antarctica on my weather channel and it's negative 62, on well, my weather app, I should say, negative 62. Right. Okay, Brendan, what made you happy this weekend? From your favorite Donnelly, Brendan Michael, and you guys miss me. <laughs> so I'm in the vlog a little bit during the Kentucky Derby. But what made me happy to, uh, this weekend? With sports. I love watching playoff sports. Playoff hockey, playoff basketball, the Kentucky Derby. It was utter insanity. Harden hit a game winner. It's crazy. So sports. That's fun. You had a good sports weekend. And, and, you uh, coached on Saturday and you guys won. Undefeated. 10 and 0, baby. Yep, Brennan's coaching the 14 U water polo team. 10 and 0. That's no small feat. Me and L Mac. That's right. Shout Go L Mac. To, shout out to Big Mac. Nice. All right, good night, Jeans. I love you. Have a great week. Oh, I love you too. Oh, bye. All right, Daddy, what made you happy this weekend? Well, thank you for asking. What made me happy today was hanging out with you this morning. It was thank fun. you. That was fun. We had a good good morning this morning. Yes. In Orlando before we came home. <laughs> Excellent. How about you, Ryan? What made you happy today? Yo, what made me happy today? Um. <sighs> Come on. Man. No, this weekend. This weekend. Combined uh, weekend. Everything was awesome. Uh, you guys. You missed home. us. Oh, thank you. Yeah, I miss you so bad. Um, <laughs> um, you guys getting home safely, I guess, and going out to the charity event and stuff. That was fun. I ate so many, like, sliders. <laughs> they were they good, were too. Really good. How did you have, Ryan? He took the pickles like, off, though. I took the pickles off. I, I ate really his good. pickles. Pickles are my favorite. Yeah. Um, How did you have? What? How many did you have? Like, six. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Yeah, it was crazy. So, How many did Brandon have? He um, said he had, like, eight. Yeah. <laughs> eight. eight um, <laughs> um. That's pretty much it. That's and knowing I'm gonna golf tomorrow. Oh yeah, tomorrow's Can't golf. Can't wait to get out back on the golf course. You know, we had just to um, fill you guys in. So we, the a charity event we went to was at a an Irish pub, and we had fish and chips. In um, yes. in honor of our trip to England, they were so good. Like, yes. were so good. Oh, all right. Feet right See now. you guys later. Thanks for watching. Be sure to thumbs up and subscribe. See you later.